Okay, I want to talk about some PPEs that you need to uh, bring when you're going to do uh, a uh, work around mangroves in the coastal area. Uh, of course, you need uh, rubber boots is a good thing. If it's not that deep, waders, if you're into uh, uh, deeper waters, um, of course, if you're in the sun, nothing like uh, sunscreen, bug repellent. And uh, if you're working in a heavily wooded area, it is not a bad idea to have a helmet, to have some eye protection. It's very important. If where you're working, there's a lot of um, poison ivy and um, you know, poisonous plants, it's used to use gloves, long sleeves. And uh, if it's uh, very open, you can even use a hat that is going to protect you and give you some shade. So that's pretty much the PPE you will need when you're working in a mangrove area. So these are some of your tools. You need a measuring stick. This is a very good one. We put some orange tape on it to mark the seats and the uh, 10 foot mark. But you can use, also use a uh, two inch pipe. We have machetes if needed. This is a lot of brush. Nothing like a machete that's going to help you out a little bit. And, um, but a tool that you're going to use a lot is this handsaw. You know, mostly for one inch and up uh, branches. And if you're going to be doing a lot of lateral cutting, this is a tool that you're going to be using a lot. So again, we have all sorts of machetes and loppers for uh, branches that are oh, maybe uh, half an inch and above till about inch, inch and a half. And we have this very good tool, extended lopper, that cuts uh, uh, branches that are taller. And it has a diameter here cut of about three quarters of an inch. And of course, this pole saw is telescopic and it helps us cut branches that are up to about two, two and a half inches, but mainly for one, one and a half and twos. So those are your tools.